guys welcome back to another episode of no man's sky so today we got um i believe we got our ship refueled we're all good to go uh we need to warp i'm pretty sure so if we just check our log warp to another system so we will have to warp so it's perfect and we'll see where we can actually go from here i'm not sure where we want to go exactly but um We'll see what we got once we get out to the stars. So we should get a message up. Okay, so let's see here. We're gonna want to go to our map. And... I think, let's uh, just check what line, galaxy core is this direction, so not sure how far we can actually go from here. Can we go? No, we can't go to that one, but we can go to this one. This is a Gex system. So we'll jump to that one. Not sure what the threat level or economy is like, so we'll have to just hope for the best. <laughs> and that should complete the mission for that. Oh, right next to the space station, too. Alrighty then, let's check out the space station before we do anything. We'll probably get a, um, yeah, figured. Guidance system malfunction. Okay, so we're going to check out this uh, space station and see what they got to trade. Need to figure out where the <laughs> door is. This is a brand new one. This is like procedurally generated, so. I'll have to go in here. Yeah, see what I mean by the, the gates are sometimes really tricky to come into. And the lighting in each station is a little bit different too. I've noticed, I've been in red, uh, red station lighting, um, blue, and I think there's well, obviously purple, but once what we've gone to so far are purple. And let's see what we can come up with for the economy. I'm not sure. I, I wanted to go in here just to make sure we save the system. But there's other things that we might be able to get in here as well. Let's see, what do they got for resources? Uh, some, something. Thank you. 
So I was flying around for a bit trying to find basically one of these things. Every exotic world like this has usually a rare item that you can pick up. It's kind of like a, a glitch uh, relic kind of thing. So last episode what I found was this um, shell type thing that we can use on our base. Um, this world has one too. You can usually find them on like these really weird... Um, I don't know, World of, War, World of the War or War of the Worlds uh, kind of style thing. So if we pick that up, we can save that to our inventory. They had a little uh, question mark, yellow question mark around them. So you can kind of figure that out. Uh, what we do need, though, is a bunch of iron. And we're going to pick up some of that quickly. Just so we have something to work with and we're gonna need one of those don't know how we're doing on ship fuel but we need to have one of those there uh, what else do we need ferrite oxygen we need more oxygen so I'm pretty sure we have to go to another planet I'm going to create that because we need one of those um, things. Oh, you know what? I it says uh, it says ferrite, not steel plate. Whoops. Okay, let's uh, just make sure we're out of the range for the sentinel. We'll mine this out. How much do we need? Fifty. Not sure where he is. He's in range at the moment. There we go. Okay, so now we just need oxygen. Where can we find oxygen? There's some carbon over there. I'm not seeing any oxygen. We might need to wander a little bit and see if we can't find a node for that. Because we're going to need um, a little bit in order to make another warp cell thing. Let me grab that wheat though. Uh, let's see here. Okay, that helps with our, um, what do you call it thing? Alright, so I found uh, this crash site. It's one of the missions that we needed to go to. And uh, there's this ship here, so we're gonna actually clean that up. Uh, it's a um, hauler, um, basically a cargo vessel for storing and shipping a lot of things. Now it's only a class C, but it will um, it can always be turned down into scrap if we want parts from it later. So I'm going to compare it and then claim ship. And then we can repair it later. 
Um, there's also some other stuff here that we can grab. Um, nothing found in there. Got some oxygen. Some rusty metal that we can grab for some parts. Uh, what else we got? We got some slime. Maybe we'll get a technology module from that. Uh, yeah, we did. We got a bolt blaster one. Nice. Uh, class S even. Alright, so we need to repair this with... It says 5 chromatic metal, but I have a little bit extra from that. Alright. So, no, there are no signs of life. Extract records. Uh, somebody called Artemis. Uh, upgrade mining beacon, or mining beam. Okay, so we're probably going to need that. Not sure what we're going to need for it, but we'll see what we can come up with. Now that uh, we're going to want to install that. Actually, we'll, we'll hold on off on installing that for the moment because we will need some space, but I don't have anything to upgrade the multi-tool with just yet. So, um... We will, however, need to install. Oh, that's Starship. Uh, that one. So the multi laser. We're going to need wireling looms and hermit seal. <laughs> hermit seal. <laughs> Hermatic seal or whatever. So we can craft one of those up. And for that, we're going to need carbon nanotubes. I'm going to have to uh, disable that installing thing. Just unpin it so we can kind of... thought I unpinned it. guys so we got uh, to the space anomaly finally and we're on the path of finding Artemis so I got some help from uh, Pilo and Nav Nada I think it's Nava or Nada something like that 
uh, the uh, purest entity up there. Um, and while I was there, I ended up uh, unlocking a Atlas Pass version 1, so we'll be able to get in those um locked containers the ones that are like cylinders so we'll be able to get in those i'm not sure if there's any other use for those other for this card other than that but we'll be able to at least get into them now and sometimes find things like warp cells um i'm not sure if there's warp cells but there should be um the antimatter which we can easily make warp cells out of and i think we also get the um the warp drive um housing as well from those so we'll be able to get a little bit more resources for sure outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and i'll see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out